You keep sneaking up on me. You do that shit one more time. I'm a. Oh shit. All right, yeah, you know what it is. Wolf of Among Us. Wolf of um, the Wolf of um, the 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 Among Us Wolf. The fucking Wolf of Wall Street. That's Among Us. The member. The biggest blood. Test, 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 test. Wolf of Among Us episode five. Episode five. Episode five. I'm that guy. If you walk around, you gonna meet the fight on my life. I might take yours, nigga. What you doing at the store? You got cravings, nigga. You want some candy or some ice cream? Maybe some chips to go with that. You got some dip, nigga. You need some dip to go with that. <laughs> Nigga, go get a Kit Kat, break it into two. Where your bitch at? <laughs> I know, but do you? I don't really know what the fuck is going on with this. Mm. They like, damn, you got a new dude? <laughs> Little bitch, you got a new boo? What? Whatever the reason the controller doesn't want to work anymore so i'm gonna be using the 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 keyboard and mouse which i never do never mind the ps5 has come through success we prevail once again niggas thought they could stop us they said if i take his controller away did a nigga ain't did a nigga not shit First of all, it don't matter what I got in my hand. I'm going to go crazy with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But second of all, the niggas can't stop us no matter what. Look, you fuck niggas got one life. I got two fuck nigga. <laughs> God damn, bro. I don't know what the fuck is going on. It's just, I got to calm down. I need to relax. I need to just. <sighs> Too much going on. I'm overstimulated as fuck. Like the last 30 minutes, everything is, just, I don't know last couple days in general and it's all just like sinking in right now and things are just like not 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 aligning properly but that's life it is what it is and i'm not gonna let it get the best of me not on camera at least as, soon as i turn this motherfucker off i'm about to go make bad decisions in life nah i'm just kidding man let's get into the motherfucking start episode five episode five cry wolf i'm finna kill everybody because that's how i'm feeling right now i'm on that timing i mean your eyes and the teeth you're not really supposed to do that are you Bitch, shut the fuck up <laughs> What you mean, pause? Not if I can avoid it. No, it's all good, but, um... <sighs> Let me lock in. Lock in. It's a part of being a professional, my baby. It's a part of, it's a part of that. No. Holly's sister, Lily. I just don't know what Bigby's doing. If he, if he cares about it. I don't give a fuck. If he even gives a shit. Nope. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't I'm it? I'm just doing all this for no fucking reason. I don't give a damn. We're destroying the Stupid tree. Stupid ass bitch. Like, what you fucking? What no! The, what the fuck is you questioning me for? We're not burning the tree, Snow. Hey. You're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? You don't gotta do. Uh, does he even care? I don't gotta be doing this in the first Maybe place. Get sent up, but you're my friend, Colin. I wouldn't do that Fuck to you. Fuck Colin too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, back shots. I'm just kidding, y'all. I'm I'm cool. Oh God, Big B. This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart. And the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Bigby, wait. When you get the crooked man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. Discussing shit. I'm punching that nigga. First thing. First thing I do, I'm punching his ass. No, I'm just playing. Can I skip this? Cry Wolf. You've come a long way. I don't I don't know who the cricket man is. Like who he's supposed to be. He's supposed to be the cricket man? 
Yeah, you know me. I picked the coldest option ever to end the last episode. Zesty ass puff. And if my envoys are correct, you haven't had a lot of rest recently. Put that little fucking cap gun down, little bitch. Oh, really? Please, Sheriff. Relax for a moment, will you? Do you want a drink? Something to eat? Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really a carpaccio. It's lobster. Sirloin. Don't misunderstand the situation here. We are not friends. And you're in no position to offer me anything. On the contrary, Sheriff. And I don't wish to contradict you here. Unless you got Fanta Orange. Mine have been friendly for a long while. I'll now. take that right now. Ever I'll since take one I of those. Aboard these shows. Oh, Crane, not me. You what know, are we talking about? Fable Town has been over very here. accommodating of my humble ventures. Damn, bro. I'm really not fucking focused right now. I need a second. Because I'm not listening. I'm not paying attention to shit. And this is gonna, this is gonna turn out bad. So give me like... Give me like 10 seconds to really just lock the fuck in and put everything else to the side. <sighs> I got a real nasty ball of energy in my gut right now that just makes me want to just wreak havoc. Who's in control? Me or the ball of energy? <laughs> Not me. <laughs> Never said a bad word. And that relationships work till these ends. Blame Crane. Uh, if all crane else fails, you do whatever or you blame wanted. Crane. I'm not Crane. No, you're not. What do you think you're doing? He's He's gonna gonna Mr. Me. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Sit down, Jersey. Well, Sheriff, for the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You're destroying this town. You've been doing it for ages. Destroying this town? I'm only here what for the bitches in the drinks. Bitches in the drinks. Oh, bitches in the drinks. Slavery, kidnapping, extortion, murder. I know Trace what Long's ass would be involved in this shit. Corruption of fable <laughs> town. I would call it that nigga's not a good guy, huh? Desperate I don't really know like the details about things, but like I, some I heard he's not a good dude. Against me. I'm a well connected. What should he try to tell you? Well you only here for the bitches and the drinks. Do you like to take their shots at me? Don't try to play me. It won't work. I'm not trying to control you. I have no need for treachery, Bigby. I do everything right out in the open. Mm. But I can understand the confusion, and I'm truly sorry about the trouble all this has caused you. And I hope you believe me when I say, Sheriff, that I sincerely mean to make it up to you. The recent murders that have gotten such attention as of late, I don't relish telling you that they were perpetrated. You're gay. You want to suck my way. dick, bro? Like what? Gay. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you and to assure you that it's over with. You really don't fucking need bluff. to worry I'm a bluff. further. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know who I did already it. know who did it. Forgive me, Sheriff, for doubting your acumen. But who do you think committed these crimes? It's been a long couple of days for you. Perhaps One of you niggas. Somewhat unscrewed. It was you! Give me this employee bullshit. <laughs> I know it was you. <laughs> what must I say to convince you that I'm innocent, dear? It wasn't me. I have complete respect for you and your job, I really do, but I'm sorry. I simply can't divulge the transgressor. You really shouldn't worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. No, I'm gonna deal with it They're right gonna staple now. his shit yeah, back right. up here. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation? The man said he'd take care of it. The fuck up, You pussy. know who did it. Now tell me. No fucking way I'm telling you anything. After what you did. I'll That's do it enough. again. I was you next. It wouldn't come to this. You wanna go be with your brother? You wanna go be with your brother? If you have to know, oh. it was Georgie. Damn. How the boss a rat. Like I said, I'd be handling the matter if you don't mind. That's not true. Sure. You're setting him up. You got what you wanted, so just sit down now. 
Yellow Wolf. Yeah, I killed him, so what? Yellow Wolf. You piece of shit. I should have fucking known. Look, the fact is, George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So, let's work something out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits, and I think you've far exceeded yours. But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this! And then you attempt told me to, to kill blame him. me for it. You will be silent while we discuss what to do with you. This is right, bollocks, sis. You're just gonna let him do this? So what do you say, Sheriff? Can we discuss terms? You can have Georgie. Consider it a gift. Ensuring our continued cooperation. What the hell? Take this fucker. Take okay, all I'm of taking both of you. Fuck. I think I'll be taking both of you. Highly You're not doubted, taking me, but... you fucking punts. Fuck what the punts? fuck is this shit? Pussy. You said you'd Cunt. cover for us. Fuck, nigga. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with him, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You can't give a fuck if I'm the one who... Who the shit do you think you fuckers are? Get the fuck out of here! I do apologize, Nigga, sheriff, what is this? But I think it's best Why am I at PertCon no right now? I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit, but he's not taking me anywhere. I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? Yeah, what the fuck? You're gonna make sure we all go down this shitter with you? I could grab I that nigga. You. I'm with all of that. I'm running out of patience, crooked man. I don't have time to fuck around here. This could have gone so well. Or what you gonna do? But you just had to complicate things. What you gonna do? To speak the truth, I've never been a very good mediator. Why negotiate when you can just decide? Hmm, tough ass line. Oh my god, she's in the mirror. She's gonna... That's kind of hard, but that's scary as fuck. <laughs> Did I miss anything good? Well, look at you all fixed up. I know her pussy smell like old wet rags. God damn, nigga. You gonna break a table on my head? What was that? A, a folding chair? You! I just like punching that nigga. I ain't gonna lie. Ah, 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 ah. The fuck out the way, pussy. Ah, you ain't shooting shit. You're done, wolf. Come on, we're pretty much done here. Fuck you. Ah! you, but I'll be glad to see The fuck up, pussy. Look at you. You niggas is uncoordinated. Damn. Oh God. Oh. This way. To the left. Let me do something crazy to him. Do him worse. No, pick it up. Do him worse than that. Come on, please. Come on, Georgie. Oh, shit. I know. I know. Is he like the other ones? Can he die? Because he don't change forms or nothing. Ah, get there. Get there. God damn. This nigga's strong! Oh, we on go mode. We on go mode. Okay, Han. Drift King, nigga. What are we doing? Okay. Oh, yeah, get there. Why would you randomly just close in on me like that? I guess. Up. Up. This is so loud. Oh my god. 
the controller down for a second. Yeah, get there. Come on, get there. Get there. Now he go B mode. He go B mode. Ah, get there. Oh shit! Fuck the six door that? car. That was a uh, crooked man. I could have, I could have jumped on his. Ah, hey, I look. He should have went on his shit. Whatever, we're here now. Why do they make me do that if, if it's just gonna end up with failure in any ways? in there come on what the fuck was the point of all this if you was just gonna go back to where you like we could have both casually just came here if this if this was the end location Did that big B, are you proud? Holy shit. Are he really leaking? They didn't lock the door or anything, like, huh? Come on, we can't stay here. Oh, oh. hang on. <laughs> I need a minute. Okay. I'm here. Shit. Hello, Big B. I hope you'd come to your senses. <laughs> oh, crooked man's the one you want. But of course, you're too much of an idiot to see that. Ah, uh, Loki tried to. Or maybe you just like me too much to let me go. That it, Sheriff? I'm taking you in, Georgie. Let's go. You gonna carry me? Please, Sheriff. Haven't you done enough? Look at him. He's dying. You can't seriously want to protect this guy. You know what he did. I'm not going anywhere. It isn't his fault. He's a murderer. Faith and Lily, he's the reason they're dead. Look, I know he made a few mistakes. We all have. Mistakes? Fox, he made sure they couldn't talk with those damn ribbons, and then he killed them. You're wearing one yourself. Doesn't that bother you even a little, knowing that man yeah, murdered? Come on, what's the magic does. behind the ribbons? Tell me, come so on, it's please. It's fucking fault, then. I you didn't fucking... Mean... Uh, you're gonna throw me to the fucking wolf, too? You know I didn't have a goddamn choice. What the fuck? Gah? I did what I had to! What the fuck, girl? You can't mm. fucking blame me for that. Look, I'm sometimes just... you just have to do what you're told. Why'd you do it then, huh? If it's not your fault, then what the fuck happened? <sighs> Ooh. Look, Ooh. Faith and the others tried to pull a run on us. And as you can Come imagine, on, bro. the cookie man wasn't too thrilled. This background, but dude. Course, like, I gotta... The big boss didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. I gotta blur yeah. that. So he told me to take care of it. You think I don't know what that means? Either I do what he says or I'm the one getting dealt with. So I fucking killed him. I know you and guys are all pawns in this shit. Like I need it's to. It's not my fault. The crooked man gave the order. He told me to kill them, and then he fucking sold me out. Well, you're still the one who pulled the trigger. Right. Nobody held your hand and made you go through with it. Good decision. Fine. Believe what you want. I can tell you've made up your mind. Doesn't matter if it's fucking true or not. Go ahead and arrest me then. 
But it won't bring back Lily or Faye. It won't free your friend Nerissa. And I'm just the sap taking the fall for the whole thing. It must be so easy being you. Just come in here and blame me for all this shit. Job's done, right? Mm -hmm. George is the bad guy. Mm -hmm. It's all his fucking fault. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, oh. But what was I supposed to do? You don't know what it's like, Bigby. How could you know? At the end of the day, you're just like him. Coming here, talking about options. Like it was that simple. Stop complaining and take responsibility for what you did. You murdered Faith and Lily. You put those fucking ribbons around their necks. You had the power to let him go, but you chose not to. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Bro, can we stop with this if background? Them, we couldn't have got a different angle. What would you have me do? Kill her? Georgie, don't. It was them or Vivian. So you tell me if Free Lily meant she had to die. Well, who is you Vivian still think to I this had a nigga? Fucking choice. What are you doing? I told you. You don't know the fuck about anything. Wait. How is she involved in all this? This is the original. The girl with the ribbon. I'm sure you've heard the stories. Couldn't take it off. Couldn't talk about it. Oh, I don't know. I'm, I don't know what that is. Y'all do? Let me know. Quiet, to ensure absolute discretion. You promised you wouldn't. All that magic is connected to this little thing. You remove hers, and the spell's broken. They're all free. But you know what happens to her? The same thing that happened to Faith. So don't you come in here and tell me I fucked up. What the hell, Georgie? We were supposed to look out for each other. I trusted you. You can't fucking blame me. You're not innocent here either. I know that. But did it happen? I didn't know if like X or this? B. Wait, those were your ribbons? You're in on this? I thought you cared about them. I do. Of course I do. You have to understand, nobody was supposed to die. When we built this place, it, it was just a stupid idea, a gimmick. Discretion is our guarantee. That's how it started anyway. This was supposed to be our place. We were going to be in charge for once, and nobody would try to control us or use us. That was the point. And the crooked man showed up, and everything just turned to shit. So, do you get it now? Why I couldn't just... If you still think it's so fucking simple, then you do it. Go right How ahead. bad did that shit cut this nigga? Kill her then. Do I see his insides? What are you doing? Break the spell. Save the fucking day. Stop it. I told you. Sometimes all your options are shit. I'm not playing this game, Georgie. I won't kill her. Don't talk about me like I'm not even here. Please. You think this is hard for you? My life is such a fucking burden on your conscience. Don't I get a say? It's my life. Like it was either of yours to I literally give up said in I'm the not first gonna do place. It. Vivian, I'm not gonna kill you. I know that. Wait. I'm sick of everyone thinking that they can just do what they want with my I life. She, I thought she was about to bully. it would be different here. But it's all the fucking same. Vivian, I didn't mean... Do you think I wanted to be this person? What I did to Faith and Lily? To all of them. Vivian, wait. Is she dead? Ass? Is she gonna pull it? I have to look Gwen and Hans in the eye and pretend I don't care. I have to forget what I've done to them. Dude, I want to see what happens. I took away from them. <laughs> I look at Nerissa and I hate myself. Vivian. I can't pretend anymore. What are you doing? Vivian. Don't. Oh, oh. Vivian. Oh, shit. No. Nigga, what the fuck? How? Fuck. No, 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 no. That you motherfucker just disconnected. Like, how your, your head was just on with some Vivian. Elmer's glue? Shit. No. <laughs> That shit was just stuck on there with some Elmer's glue, my boy. Like that shit just fell off. Vivian, so no I head. Didn't fucking mean it. I was just. Oh. Oh. So you gonna die with her? With your little, with your little Volcom star tattoo. Oh fuck! Get up. The sticker inside is out. Don't think so, Big B. Damn! I'm gonna die here. I think we both know that. Just make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. 
really fuck him up for me, all right? For both of us. He's gonna have it worse. Don't worry. Good. Old foundry by the river, all right? Shepherd Metalworks. He'll be there. Fucking asshole. You wanna finish me off now? Gay. Gay? <laughs> or do you plan to kick me around a little first? Imagine. The limbs off one by one. Imagine I heard. Mm. Right. Well, whatever it is, just get it over with. I'm not sticking around for much longer. I'm not like that. I'm not like that. I'm not like that. Sure, it's not, not like that, man. No more games, all right. We both know how this ends. <laughs> just make it quick. I know what I did. <laughs> Let's not draw this out. Fuck it. All right, Georgie. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> damn! Why would you? Why would you? Huh? I thought he was gonna cut his throat or like something. Oh no, man. Adonis in this motherfucker, man. <laughs> That's Drake's son? <laughs> ick. Got the ick. Just a couple dead niggas inside. Yeah. Shepherd Metalworks. Check out the whip. Check out the six door vehicle. Still more. He's here, all right. Oh, yeah. Of course. He's kind of just like me as, as far as strength. He reminds me so much of myself when I was younger. So this is where they've been sending these. Say I'm assuming they already expecting the my my company. <laughs> Who's this Mary talking to me? The big bad wolf. The big bad. You used to be something. The big bad blood. I know I was a member. You was around all these women. You didn't get head once. They literally let their heads disconnect from their body before they gave you any bit of it. That's crazy. They used to fear you. They'd hide anywhere their small shivering bodies were bit. The fuck up, bitch, before I drink this shit. I'll drink this shit right now. You think I give a fuck? Fuck life, nigga. I'm just kidding. Mmm, the torture mechanism. Where are you going, bro? Oh, so y'all making silver bullets here. Silver. The big bad wolf. Oh my god, that was hard. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> it's about time you showed up. I had to take care of some things first. Little errand. Hello to you too, bitch. That's nice. Ah, Bigby. 
I see you made it here in one piece. I do apologize, but I have some business to attend to. I leave you in the capable hands of my associate. Come find me when you finish, dear. Don't worry. This won't take long. Get out of my way now. Don't make this worse. Aw, he doesn't want to play. I'm sure you'll persuade him. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. I'm just what kidding, I wasn't gonna do <laughs> stealing punches while my back is turned. Didn't your mother What what did you do to me? Whoa! My nigga be sounding like a Pomeranian sometimes. I'm not gonna lie, but I, I respect it. <laughs> what the hell? Her ass fast. This bitch floating like an outlast, uh, like the wall rider. Can I move? Oh, I'm going that way. I'm done. Whoa. <laughs> What? I pressed it. That was supposed to happen. She got glass everywhere. Like, where do you even hit her? In her sternum, nigga. Knocked the fucking wind out her chest, nigga. Why am I just getting packed the fuck out? I'm hitting every command. Excuse me? I've, I've been there. I didn't know he could just pop in and out of this form like this. Oh, it's two of them? Three of them? Oh. Oh, okay. It's 150 of them. Oh, yeah, it's 200,000. <laughs> Shit, let's get to it, I guess. Let's get to it, I guess. Huh. Huh. Let's get to it, niggas. Uh. Smink. Come on, man. Make a manga. Are they fucking you up? Oh, shit. The real me? They got shadow clones. This bitch got glass shadow clones. She thinks she's Haku or something.
with shit like the three little pigs. So I huff and I puff and I blow that bitch down. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Come on, talk about it. So that's the real one right there, right? That's the real one. That's the last one left. Let's get to it. Let's get to it. She is not escaping. You are not escaping. Not today, my baby. Wait, what? Was that her or not? That was her? Why'd they make that... <laughs> Why'd they make that last part like Naruto versus Sasuke? Nah, she was getting to it. I ain't gonna lie. She was fucking me up. It was a... When they was all jumping on me, I know Big B was low-key taking it because he was kind of turned on a little bit. He was like, damn. I ain't never had this many bitches on me at one time. Crazy. And this nigga's gonna stare at me like a loser. Knowing damn well he can't... His, his vision like this. That's what his vision looked like all the time. Hello, Bigby. You look tired. Give me one good reason not to rip you apart right now. This gun holds six shots <laughs> especially designed. Nick said, Blick! There's my reason. Oh, shit. I won't miss next time. Before you do anything with me, I thought I should point out a few things. Snow White wants you to bring me back to the woodlands, doesn't she? And that's what I want. Snow's not here. You're dealing with me now. That may be true, but I'd advise against defying your new boss. At least for the time. She did tell me to bring him in bring alive, huh? Alive. Look, all I ask for is the chance to speak for myself in front of the community. Yeah, fuck you. And I'm sure Miss White would agree that I should be given a fair trial. Can we at least agree on that? I will have a trial. Are we clear? The whole town will be calling for your execution. Why would you want me to bring you back there? Why don't you let me worry about that? Because you got a bigger plan in mind, but there's no reason but, for us to be at each other's throats here. That's funny. It's just gonna give me the option to be able to kill him or not. This is just a precaution. I'm sure you understand. I'm no murderer, Mr. Wolf. I didn't kill those women. And I think you know that. All I'm asking for is a chance to explain my side of the story. If you're not a killer, then what are you? I'm a businessman, not a killer. There's still a lot you have to answer for. And I will, as long as you agree to my terms. Because I'm not saying another word until I'm brought before the community. And I don't think I'm being unreasonable. If you decide to do something stupid, murder me you won't get your answers but you will have a difficult time explaining yourself to miss white and the rest of this miserable town that's true that's true you're often reckless and i worry you're not thinking am i willing to be the villain an honest question what do you really care about here where this case is concerned i mean do you really want the truth or do you just want to look like the hero because those are you. two very different things. You're smart, I'll admit that. So what I just don't understand is why you're here. I mean, you want to catch your killer, right? Georgie. Georgie dead. He's dead, isn't he? My point being, the killer has been dealt with. You've won. You really think I'm that stupid? I understand you have an obligation to bring me in, but you can brighten up a little. It's over. So, shall we get going? I'd rather not dawdle. You know, I'm actually looking forward to seeing Miss White again. My previous interactions with her have gone rather well. All right, let's go. Hand over the gun. I think I'd rather hold on to it, if you don't mind. What do you say? Hey! I'm sure Miss White will be pleased. Such a reliable pup. I understand why she'd want to keep you around. 
You're under I don't know arrest. if I get one chance, so I had to do the you cuff him. I should have hit that nigga, man. Should have hit that nigga, man. <clears throat> they wouldn't have even you known. They would have been like, you could, if you fire. punched him in that in that bad eye, bro, they would have just thought it was just like that. I wanted to hit that nigga so bad, but like, maybe what if I hit him and? I know, I know, but we have to do something. Are you fucking kidding me? I know, I sure know, he's coming? I know. Yes, you'll have an opportunity to. He's back. <gasps> the crooked man. Thank God. Motherfucker. Are you okay? It's been hours. We were worried you'd run into some trouble at the crooked man's place. Well, he didn't make it easy. What happened? It doesn't matter. He's here. We got him. We can talk about it later. You did well, Sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know. I'm Imagine just Snow White is the real villain here. Hmm. It's about time you showed up. Hmm. She's behind all of this. Yes, they're in it together. For? You killed Lily. She was my sister. What do you have to say for Where yourself? Where the fuck do you get off? You think you have the right and to just do this me? to people? You're a fucking to crook. This, you should be ashamed. Shit hole. Everyone, can I have your attention? Thank you all for coming here on such short notice. I know normally we'd schedule a formal hearing, but considering the circumstances, I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. The crooked man is charged with the murder As of I Faith and... As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not me. What? It was Georgie? Georgie? I don't mean to interrupt you, Miss White. Georgie may have killed them, but you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who killed my sister? Well, where is he? Yeah, you're gonna bring that shithead in too, aren't you? Yes, yeah, sheriff. Where is that rotten scoundrel now? Is he still out there? I sincerely hope not. Well, where is he? Sheriff? Nigga, what the fuck kind of stupid ass, dumb ass uh, choices? How the fuck wouldn't you say he died? Why, why the only thing was, I killed him. I killed him. Like, we know what that's leading to. The nigga died in combat amongst a quarrel, a scuffle. Shit pissing me off. Allow me. Justice has already been dispatched. What the Bigby fuck? Executed him. He's what? Dead. So you see, the culprit has been punished. There's no. That need doesn't change for this. anything. We'll deal with it later. But right now, you're the one I'm concerned with. You called the shots. Georgie made that perfectly clear. In which case, you still have a lot to answer for. And I was I told don't... I would be allowed to speak. Mm. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges? If you'd wait a moment. Let her finish. Then you can have your say. Got it? If you insist. <clears throat> you are charged with the murder of Faith and Lily, which Georgie carried out on your order, inciting violence against various members of the Fabletown community, including the attempted murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Twice. A misunderstanding. Aiding and providing monetary support for the forced prostitution at the Pudding and Pie. Additionally, you are charged with multiple counts of fraud, extortion, racketeering, and the illegal possession and sale of magical artifacts. And for being a condescending prick. Now, is there anything you would like to say? Snow, mm. Snow needs some dick, all, bruh. I had nothing to do with Faith and Lily. So you can strike that one from your little record book. Bullshit! Second. Like hell you Stop didn't. the charade. We know you're involved. Come on, it's obvious. And there's all the other crap he's done. Everyone just shut up for a minute. You wanted a chance to talk, well go ahead. What? We all know he's guilty. What the fuck does he need to speak for? The crooked man has committed crimes against this government and most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if proven, are enough to justify death. I said, give me one of them gold chains, I'll let you go. Your body will be committed to the witching Where it fucking belongs. That's so right. let's get but on with it, then. But we promised you a chance to defend yourself. 
and I won't rob you of that right. As long as it passes this bill, you can go, my nigga. If we're ever going to pull ourselves together and make something of this town, we have to start doing things correctly. No more snap judgments, no more secrets. We are going to treat everyone fairly, even when they don't deserve it. This is ridiculous. Uncuffed for what? Here you go. You have the floor. Thank you, Miss White. You've all met Georgie. I don't have to tell you what kind of person he was. He was a total scoundrel, lacking in any sort of moral fiber. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Oh, Are you going to get to your point or what? Georgie was working for me, yes. But he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business. And for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand, he murdered two of his most faithful employees. I had nothing to do with it. This, this is such bullshit! He's always been a bit of a powder keg. Georgie seemed pretty convinced he didn't have a say in the matter. He clearly misunderstood my intention. Really? I would never authorize such an act. Any of you actually believe this bullshit? Holly, please. Tell them, Bigby. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? I answered your questions. I was willing to cooperate. What's he talking about? Yeah, and your goons attacked me. Did you forget that part? They get a bit carried away sometimes, it's true. Loyal to the end. They do it because they want to protect me, as I've protected them. You understand wanting to protect what you care about, don't you? You'd do anything. You might even give up an innocent man just to save someone. What's he talking about? Yeah, right. They don't do it because they want to protect you. You intimidate people. You scare tactics. They're afraid if they don't follow orders, they'll end up dead. Let me explain this to you. My employees are just that. Hired help. I see some of them are here among you. They are not my slaves. They are all free to make their own decisions, as Georgie was. What about Lily? She wasn't free. She wasn't given a choice. Do you really think she wanted... that any of those girls wanted their lives like that? I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry that your sister asked me for help, and I'm sorry that I decided against my better judgment to give her a distasteful job. Right, and you kept them in debt so they couldn't leave. Yeah, that's what you did to us. How you kept us all you in You forget line. it was not me who put you in that position. You all act like I'm some kind of tyrant. When your government abandoned you, Left you poor and helpless, sniveling on street corners. I, I was, was there, there to, to look, look out, out for you. you. Okay. Okay. Yes, but... Wasn't I? You're the fucking problem here, not us. Really? What about Auntie Greenleaf? Oh shit, her what about her? not uncommon. She left everything she had back in the homelands. Everything that matters, anyway. With nowhere else to turn, she came to me for help. Mm. And what did I do for you? What did he do? You got my tree back. Oh, I shit. I got her tree back. And in turn, we used her magic to help poor fables get glamours. Because I helped her, she was able to make a living, provide for herself. And what did they do? She wanted my tree destroyed, but Bigby refused. What? You were gonna burn her tree? Snow, why would you want that? Is that true? Don't blame Snow, she had her reasons. Greenleaf was using her magic to help Crane and the Crooked Man. That's why Snow wanted your tree burned. That's not why. It wasn't her fault. You can lie to yourself, but you can't lie to me. You hated Crane, and you hated him for wanting to fuck you, and you being too soft to notice God what he damn. did. <laughs> it had nothing to do with the Crooked Man. We've made some mistakes. I've made some mistakes. But believe me, I truly want what's- <laughs> Imagine a nigga being so ugly, you get that mad. Just cause he wants to fuck you. Just cause he think you cute. He wanna go on a little date with you, but he's that fucking ugly. That it just literally boils your blood down to your core. The simple sight of that nigga. That's insane. Ugly ass nigga, bruh. Fuck. Some of y'all look like that too. I'm just playing, bruh. <laughs> no, no, you don't. 
That nigga is so beautiful. It's best for this town. And that may not always be clear right away. But I want you all to know that I care deeply about all of you. Gaslight. And so does the sheriff. Yeah, right. I can't promise you perfection. No one can. Things haven't been great for a while now, but we'll do better at protecting you from people like him. The crooked man's been exploiting you, exploiting your hope for a better life. You would go to him for help, and he would take that weakness and add it to his strength. And if things didn't fall exactly his way, someone would die. We're not gonna tolerate this shit anymore. The debts are wiped. His business is closed. He's done. They're right. You're all still afraid of him. Something Even now. drastic has to happen. But you needn't be. His contamination of this town is over. It's a whole episode and those after girls this left. Will have their justice. Oh wait, is it? Is this the last episode? Very good. Very good. The sentiment is surely appreciated, Miss White. But it doesn't disguise the fact that these accusations are completely unfounded. The sheriff simply doesn't have a particle of evidence linking me to the- Georgie boat. was working for you! Bigby got a confession A confession that, that nobody heard. Uh, no, I'm no barrister. And I, I bet shit has been disposed be of already. If Bigby weren't the only one to whom Georgie spoke. Why did he just Especially leave the bodies in there? Bigby's history. And fuck you. What are you talking about? Ah, oh, literally, okay. fuck you. Sick I didn't even read the shit. other ones. <laughs> you see what I mean? Big B? Oh, I fucked up. Maybe, maybe he's... I mean, this doesn't feel right, how we're doing this. Clem! Of course it's right. This man tormented all of you for profit. Georgie Let killed him. Let me just him. make sure I understand you. You're trying to say that I'm responsible for what Georgie did because he was working for me at the time, yes? Yes. Of course. Yes, you're responsible. Well, by that logic, Miss White should be on trial for Tweedledum's murder. Since you know Bigby works for her. That's... He killed a man. That don't make him a murderer. Doesn't it? For fuck's sake, killing someone who's trying to kill you is hardly... They were there to retrieve Crane. You didn't need to escalate things. Me? It was them. And who sent those two freaks anyway? Bigby nigga, this, and I have already discussed this. is not a fucking debate, night. nigga. We're handling it internally. Now, where have I heard that before? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle? I am the law, fuck, nigga! He was beaten to mashed apples while under your watch. Under my watch? Maybe he's right. Did you think we'd all just let that Right, go? like, I'm not You're on trial. on trial here. Don't try to turn this around on us. Besides, Crane was still deputy mayor when that happened. Right before you decided to kidnap him. She was, was trying to clear her protection. name. Oh, you're right, dear. Crane was in charge. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. That's enough. So, you won't answer for your employees' behavior. But I have but to. I must perish for This mine. is completely yes. different. We I all... did not order those two girls dead. It simply never happened. Georgie killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want to scapegoat me for their own tangled ends. But they refuse Did to I have answer a choice? for their own this crimes. Isn't right. Oh, please. Did I have a choice this to not kill Georgie? Point. We'll deal with I mean, them after we deal with you. Listen, the I know... The laws apply when we need them to. Bluebeard, please. Everyone calm down. This isn't I the mean, a certain level here. of privilege should be afforded to... to this is how it's always been. This is what I'm talking about. This is we how we do it. We to this disease world. <laughs> And ever since, Look which a nigga one of in the back to start to singing that shit was dancing. Who filled your lives with the promise of more? I gotta focus up, my fault. Who was there while they idly played in their towers, judging you, treating you as mindless children, too stupid to command your own destiny? Without stupid. me, stupid. Who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? The Lord. Who will dare challenge their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens? Who will protect you from the big bad wolf? Elon Musk. Who will be the- Bigby! Miss White! What you got for me? What's the deal, Shardy? Excuse me, I... dear. She had a little wedgie, I, I saw it. I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take a moment to catch your breath, little What's mother? she doing here? 
I'd like to... I, I need to say something. But I can't. We're kind of in the middle of something. Bluebeard. What? She has something to say, and we're gonna listen. Go right ahead. Oh, is she gonna kill herself? You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just know shut up. You oh, enslaved sure. us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose Damn, she everything got that motherfucker if we Anthony stepped Davis. just one toe out of line. And we uh, couldn't say a look word at about that it because thing. of these damn ribbons. Ooh. <laughs> but you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? Did he? Sheriff, this is highly irregular. Be quiet. We need to establish some order here. Vivian wanted you freed from the ribbons. She took her own life. I'm sorry, um, I don't think Nerissa! I know my name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. It's going to be just... He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily. That's a lie. I was in the goddamn room when I don't he give did a it. Damn Faith if it's and a lie, Lily bro. are dead because of you. <laughs> Let's the go. only two people who ever gave a damn about me. And now I can well, finally this confirms say, it. And this just confirms it. He made Georgie do it. It was always him. Georgie would have never done anything without his say so. Ever. You're going to take the word of a stupid... At least five other girls <laughs> will back me up on this. We all heard you say it. Did you now? Looks like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty. Good enough for me. Me too. So that's it, right? Run down the witching well. Nah, that's that too nigga fucking Bluebeard easy just for a person like that. Prosecute what somebody. do you mean? He's gotta no pay what. for what he did. Listen to yourselves. You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. Mm. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What, you take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You know we can't let you go free after this. What did you expect to happen here? You're getting what you deserve. Well done, then. What is the twist? I now, know there's going to be a sentence. plot twist We here. don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that. But we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison him. Lock him up forever. Somewhere he can never hurt anyone. This bitch don't be watching movies. How like, can we be sure he won't That's not a good idea. Help. We'll use magic. No. That's not good enough. Maybe there will be more if he isn't hasn't stopped. Been enough I don't get so we get rid of him. To get him out of here. We can send him Everyone, away. Everyone, listen up. Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing like on a suitable punishment. Are you that old and you don't so be I watching no movies? Going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. We should Why vote. Not? We should have a vote. Yeah, make Democratic. everybody feel. Yeah, nigga, I was literally going to say it's a democracy. Right. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Bigby? What about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should be the judge. Ha. <laughs> That makes sense to me. I guess it does. Okay. Fine. Are you sure? This isn't how it's. it's I'm gonna lie. Anti Greenleaf. Uh, she me and her okay. back blown out too. Mr. Wolf, it's your call. Snow. Just I know it'll change a lot for do her. It'll do a whole right. lot for her, man. I know it will. Yes, Sheriff. Do what you think is right. Teach him a fucking lesson. No. He has to die. We can lock him Just away. fucking get rid of him. Everyone, I'm not this way. I knew it. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> Nigga. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yep. That's what I'm talking about. I had to hit that eye, bro. I'm there so glad I got the chance to do that. I hope you all remember this moment. What the fuck are you talking Think about? Me when you try to sleep. Finish it, Sheriff. Please, we can still end it already. I'm ending that shit. It's, it's majority rules, my nigga. I'm not locking Don't that nigga up. Miss me. I think he Drake now. Hope that you miss me a little when I'm gone. Goodbye. No, I won't. <laughs> nigga said Fable Town will remember that. Y'all niggas is some gaslighting manipulators, bro. You literally just majority rule told me to do this shit. If you nigga, if I turn around and and faith. If I yes, turn around and you niggas another one of us to erase from the books.
What? Oh. <sighs> no sleep? Is that Bigby? Moaning? Uh, humming like that? Oh, hi. Sheriff Bigby. Great, great to see you. I don't know if you TJ? remember. TJ? I know who you are, Flycatcher. You, you've worked at the Woodlands for how many years oh, now? Oh, I don't know. Who's Flycatcher? <laughs> I think I've lost count. Are you going to come see the truck off? We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. Well, I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. Okay. Great. This fucking line. Who the fuck is that? Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf, Flycatcher left his keys. You got Claire Huxtable in this bitch. Is everything okay? You look. I'm. I'm sorry, Sheriff. I have to take care of this. The cycle continues. We'll talk later, okay? Oh my god, the cycle continues, bro. Good morning, Miss White. She's, she's gonna oh my god, she's gonna realize how much of a how much of a fucking responsibility this is, and it's gonna overwhelm her, and it's gonna end up pushing her to a place of having to do the same thing Crane was doing, Someone's and then people are gonna fall come. behind, and then somebody else is gonna uh, take the take take the crooked man's place. Fuck. Nigga, I didn't say you have to go. This nigga got a. Was that a four pack of country lemonade? Like my nigga, you are a pig. Why do you have that in your possession? Yellow brick roadhouse. Hmm. Oh, Garland. Jesus. I want to see what the farm looks like. We only have like five minutes. They carry me for fuck's sake. I thought sake. I was going to help give them. A shit. We forgot these. Oh, thank you. It's uh, been pretty busy around here. Morning, Sheriff. Nice fucking day. <laughs> uh, shit. Just go grab that, would you? Sorry about all this. Uh, I tried to help. Just why the hell did she have to send me and me boy away, huh? You promised me I'll get another chance. But Miss White said I had to go up to the damn farm anyway. Wait, Sheriff Bigby, I have something. <laughs> what you got, Clem? You know, he was up crying all night, poor kid. Can you give this to Miss White, please? Dad says there's no time to say goodbye, so... If you could bring it to her, she was nice. So... Yeah, sure. I couldn't take them all with me, and... She said she liked that one the best. I was going to say it's the fucking bug. I knew it, the beetle. It's a willow beetle. That's a big one. They're cool because when they're little, they have these pouches that squirt juice at you if you touch them. I'm sure Freaky she'll Yes, bug. <laughs> she said it was pretty. We're about ready to head out. This nigga got a What's fit on. What's it like at the farm? I've heard ogres live there, and, and they eat people in their sleep sometimes. God, I hope not. Do we have to go? I want to stay here. Well, we don't have a choice anymore. I'm sorry, TJ. But, uh, look on the bright side, okay? There's plenty of space to run around, uh, and a nice river nearby so you can swim all you want. Even in daytime? Yeah. You don't have to worry about the Monday seeing you. It'll be nice. <laughs> Come on. It won't be so bad. Have you been there before? No. I'm, uh, some of the animals aren't comfortable around wolves, so you wouldn't know, would you? We're all set. That's how the cookie Goodbye, crumbles, my Mr. nigga. Wolf. Goodbye, TJ. Hey, Big B. Where's your friend, Colin? Where's a fucking pig? 
How should I know? Okay, so Colin was just headed back to the room. That's crazy. Nigga said, welcome to the good Same life with this country lemonade. <laughs> Narissa, with some regular clothes? You look different outside your your regular... Oh, outside your work clothes. Hi. What's up, baby? Hi. What if I just took that ribbon Still off her neck right now? Then. So no head? Oh. Yeah. She has an attachment to it emotionally. It's not easy to forget. I know it seems like I should be able Remove to. ribbon is crazy. It's I don't, I don't even want to try it. It's okay. I get it. <laughs> Listen, I I came here because I have to tell you something. What is it? It's about what happened to Faith and Lily. I'm not sure where to start. <sighs> Faith, Lily and I, we had this plan. We we're gonna find a way out. Leave the pudding and pie for good. But then Faith decided to get some leverage. She stole a picture of Crane and Lily together. The minute Faith stole that photo, we had dirt on one of the crooked man's allies. If he found out, I... I had no choice. You have to understand. You've seen how they kept us quiet in that place. Can you imagine the lengths they go just to silence someone who had physical evidence? Narissa, just tell me what happened. I freaked out, okay? I thought if I came clean to Georgie, he'd get the crooked man to leave us alone. We could just forget the whole thing. Maybe try again in a few years. You what? So I told him everything. And I begged for mercy for all of us. I didn't want anyone to die over a picture. You were just trying to protect them. Yeah. I didn't Georgie really have time to process the things over with what the I wanted man. to say. But then, oh God. <laughs> that nigga said, give her a cigarette. I don't know what happened. It's weird. But that night at the club, Georgie came back and told me things had changed. He had to make an example of us. At the we club? Nah, because why this nigga, why that nigga Georgie low-key also looked like... You was at the club. <laughs> Bottoms up when I first met you. Could he get, could he get enough? <laughs> That's crazy. So he was at the club. It's his... Boy, boy. Boy, boy, West Coast, that's who's in charge. That's who's responsible for all of this. Treason. And while the two of us were sitting there as he was telling me this, Faith walked in and I had to watch while Georgie. Wait, so Georgie told you all this? Not the crooked man? Back at the well, you said. I know what I said. I knew her ass fucking lied, bro. But I, I was just trying to. <laughs> fuck. My bad, I'm gonna stop pausing. It wasn't the truth, was it? Hella sorry. What does it matter? I know the crooked man did it. So what if it wasn't the whole truth? It was true enough. Well. I guess uh, it's done as done. I know he ordered their deaths. I wasn't gonna let him get away with it because of a stupid technicality, especially after that night after Faith. I tried to warn Lily but she wasn't with her scheduled appointment. So I did the only thing I could do. I, I left Faith's head at your doorstep. To start all of this, to trigger the investigation. Nice. I walked her over here and I left her, just hoping that maybe if I couldn't save them. You were trying to get my attention. So you, you started all this. I just, pointed you in the right direction. People like us get forgotten all the time. The crooked man was counting on that. When we suffer, we do it in silence. And the world likes it that way. Oh no, we now now I know it's believe women and shit, but like, like never now I'm starting to feel like she he rejected her in some sort of way and she faith. just went through this Poor extensive Lily. ass plan to Nobody do this. Cares about us. Oh my God. Not really. That's not true. It is. You've just never seen it before. But now you have. 
You'll make things right. You and Snow. I don't know. Seems like no matter what I do, it's just not enough for her or anyone. I just can't win with these people. I know it might feel that way, but these people they need you, Bigby. Both of you. You two make a good team. The way you look out for each other. I'm trying other, to make a good fuck. Look out oh my for God. us. I'm just kidding. You don't see that a lot these days. I don't really know where we stand anymore. Things are just different. Huh. Things are always different. Look, Big B. After everything you've done for us, maybe they don't want to admit it, but without you, none of this would have happened. You listened when no one else would. You protected your friends, no matter the cost. And you brought justice to this town. Finally, because you brought the crooked man in, everyone saw who he really was. So from where I'm standing, you did the right thing. You've been given this job for a reason. And I left faith at your doorstep because I knew if anyone stood a chance against the crooked man, it was you. No, it doesn't matter what I do. In the end, it's all the same shit it always was. You're wrong. You've changed this place. I'm a glass half, I'm a class half empty worse, type of nigga, you know? Fable Town wouldn't be the same without I'm you. I'm in my pessimism bag. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. I need to tell you something. I have to tell you something. You're trying to place me. You like my ribbon? Do you like it? I'm sorry. I paused it at the fucking most. Like, you was probably really into it right there. But, like, I can't. I have to share this thought because it made me laugh on the inside. I thought about it being, like, somebody, somebody walking off and telling somebody, like, like an Instagram, a little Instagram girl or something, and walking off and looking back at her. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Like, it's not that funny, but it's kind of, I just wanted to share that. Maybe you giggled, maybe you chuckled. I don't know, make sure you took. Faith War One Two would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Dr. Swinehart ever- He about to have a revelation? He said he wanted to run more tests. I hope you find what you're looking for. I'll see you around. Wolf. I was right. It was her fault. It was her fault. She set that nigga. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, 68, 89, 38. What the other 60 do? 98. That discussion is waiting. It's calling me. Beast, you lied to him about. I thought that shit said you lied to him about going to Best Buy. What does that say? About seeing beauty outside the apartment, you impressed her with your detectives. Hold on, bitch. Like, <laughs> you fought him after the interrogation. Excellent fact. You gave him a drink when he asked for one in your apartment. You helped him to avoid the farm. You took him back to the witching well. You tossed him. You chose to burn him with a cigar during the interrogation. You killed him. You gave her money. You smashed up his place. Ripped his arm off at the trip chop, chopped a cheaper chopper. You drank. You pretended to be woodsmen while she passed out. You, br you brought her along with you to the trip trap. You chose to wait for him. You accepted his beetle. You slapped him during the inventory. <laughs> you stood up for him when Snow wanted to send him to the farm. That goofy ass picture. Park 30. I just popped out Park 30. God. Bro, what? That's not that last episode, was it? Oh my god if it's not the last episode that was the end of episode five i don't know bro like i really when i go to edit this i get to see like things for a little bit a little bit more than they are i have different realizations as i'm watching sometimes i'm like damn dumbass nigga to myself what y'all thinking man there's got to be an episode after this it, it, man skip this oh my god that was it wait a minute Whoa. 
Wait a minute. Okay. All right. Okay. So, okay. All right. Damn. Why am I so f white? So when does two come out? I really thought there was a whole episode after that. What the fuck? Where did I get six episodes from? I don't know. It's my gaslighting me per use. Took a while for us to play that. I know y'all been, been recommending that for a while. And I'm glad that we finally got around to it because I did enjoy this game play. And I know you guys did too. And I'm sorry it took a little bit of time for me to... I mean, let's let's be honest, bro. I've done a lot worse as far as uploading <laughs> series. I don't think this was too bad. We got through it kind of quick. Like I said, I've been busy and everything. But no, uh, this was good though. I like the, impl the implementations of the fables and stuff. Oh, that's one thing I didn't do. I didn't read none of the fables. Seen somebody in the comments like, please tell this nigga to read them bitches. Hey, my bad. Well, damn, bruh. Somebody tell me when the, uh, the second one comes out. I'm gonna Google it. But I just want you to tell me. I want to hear it from you. I knew it was some sort of plot. I was waiting for some sort of twist or something. So, so Narissa is really... Wait a minute. Shit, I don't know. We're gonna have to see. I just wanted to get the crooked man out of here. That nigga was just ugly. That's why I ain't fuck with him. He ain't do nothing wrong. He was just ugly. <laughs> I hope y'all did enjoy that gameplay. I did. And of course, I always enjoy it 30 times more because I'm sharing the experience with y'all. So make sure you drop comment about how you felt about this, my decision making, uh, whatever you want to say. Leave it in the comments below. Uh, any suggestions for new games, choice based or non choice based, whatever it is, let me know. I'm, I'm about to move on to Last of Us 2. So whatever else, let me know. I hope you had fun, Twin. I gotta get the fuck out of here, man.